Well, I'm back at uh, Hanson Quarry, um, my last two flights out of seven, and uh, the Eagles came in and had a go at me on, on landing actually, which is um, a tricky position to be in uh, because you don't have any sort of control other than abort. Um, and they did something to the motor, I think they took the propeller off, and as a result it went into a malfunction and uh, uh, started to do a, a spiral. Uh, descent, and uh, that was happening just over there uh, where those trees are, um, only sort of uh, 70 metres away. Uh, and I thought it ended up spiralling into the, um, the mound over here on top of the scalps, uh, and that's where I was going to start searching. But uh, fortunately, I thought, oh yeah, I'll give the, um, the tiny lot a go. I've always got it um, on in the um, in the EV, and uh, I tell you what, I would not have found it without that transmitter. Um, I thought it was dead set and certain, um, sort of 30, 40 metres away, sitting nice and pretty up on this um, mound of uh, scalps, and in fact it was down over uh, on the edge of those trees. Uh, the wing, one wing was up in the tree. Um, and uh, the body and uh, another and the wing were um, nearby, but uh, I would not have found it. I would have been looking in totally the wrong direction. And this is a big, um, this is a big mine site. So uh, yeah, worth worth every cent. One of those. And I tell you what, they are just so good on range and so good on um, fine tuning where you um, where you uh, point that thing, and it took me straight to it. Um, just awesome, I'm really stoked. Yeah, so, otherwise uh, another successful day, but um, yeah, had me worried for a while. Arthas out.